how to use North VPN, how this VPN works. Hey guys, welcome to Tax Express. In today's video, I'm going to show you how this North VPN works. I'm going to show you a quick review how to use this application. It's actually really, really simple, guys. So the first thing you want to do is to open your application here. As you can see, I already have this North VPN, and you can see that I have a uh, subscription available for the next year, so I have access to the whole application here on the VPN. So once you have uh, a new account here on North VPN, you might want to get a subscription in order to use the application, otherwise it just won't work. But just in case that you've already uh, created your account and now it works, I'm gonna show you what this is all about. So first of all, you're gonna see this information i'm gonna go ahead and to go like this and pause for five minutes i'm gonna go and disconnect so you so you're gonna see exactly what i'm seeing here in my uh phone so once you go into the north vpn you're gonna see that the vpn is not connected so this application works for us to be much more safer in the internet so uh this vpn is gonna save our information and the transfers that we make in the internet is gonna is gonna encrypt all our data. So that's the reason why it says VPN not connected. So the first thing you want to do once you open VPN and you have the subscription, if you select any any country here, uh, for example, I'm here in Mexico City, and I'm gonna go into Disney Plus so you can see what kind of content I have available in my country. And then what you're going to do is to select the VPN of Canada, for example, uh, so that you can see, guys, that I'm using um, with the VPN, I'm seeing another kind of information. So now here you see I have Mickey Mouse, I have Impact on the features of Disney Plus. Now that we've seen this, I'm going to close it and I'm going to connect into my VPN in Canada. So it says connected to Canada and now my information uh, has a new ip so a new ip it says that the ip that i have assigned it for my router the ip that i have assigned it for my router uh it's now it's not been changed so if i go back into destiny plus the collections and the content is quite different so it says uh, it looks like you're in the travel it says in spanish here that the content and the and the classifications might be different than your uh, country. So I'm gonna hit on accept. And as you can see, I have How I Met Your Father, I have both Bob's Burgers, I have Family Guy, I have The Simpsons. So this is kind of content that you can't see in Mexico City, but with the VPN, it's now available, okay? So if I go back into the North VPN, here you can see the connection time, your new IP address, the VPN status, and how much time are we, um, currently online into the VPN guys and if you're quite new with the VPN protocol I recommend to use the recommended tool if you don't know absolutely any information about the protocols and all that uh, we can just leave those as default and the use recommended by the North VPN and the auto connect it's highly recommended for you guys to put this on Wi-Fi network so if you connect your phone into an public Wi-Fi like an airport or a coffee shop your information will be encrypted and safe and lastly guys i strongly recommend you guys to to try to improve your security score if you clicked in here you just have to select an auto connect here you can set this up by yourself and turn on the threat protection light so this is actually uh really helpful for uh, avoid the phishing mails and all the information that might be false so you don't have to worry about that at all so there you have it guys it's actually really simple to use the uh north vpn you can change from one country to another it won't matter and the best part of this application is that it won't save all the browser information the history and that's up to you guys because these guys of north vpn they don't keep the information so as I just said before, this is totally encrypted and it won't be shared to another party or another device. So uh, just in case you have any any suggestion or question, you can leave that on the comment below. Don't forget to like this video 
and subscribe to the channel if you want to see more videos about this kind of VPNs and these applications. That will be all for today, guys. I'll see you on the next video.